On May 8, 2013, the Gillespie High School Safe Driving Team impacted minors preparing and caring for teen driving held an Act Out Loud road rally sponsored by Allstate Insurance in honor of Worldwide Safe Driving Month. There was food and live entertainment to entice the students and community members to attend. Over 1,200 students from the community and some nearby schools participated in the rally. Local business owners and students put on several activities and booths that promoted good driving decisions. There was a golf cart obstacle course where drivers wore beer goggles. The FFA hosted booths on awareness for slow moving vehicles and ATV safety. The Illinois State Police displayed their rollover simulator. Impacted has been advocating for wise driving decisions since 2008. During that time, the students have made drivers aware of the seriousness of toxication, texting, seat belt usage, and bad driving decisions. The group has put on mock crashes, mock trials, have launched local campaigns to buckle up and to avoid texting and driving. This year, Impacted worked diligently to pull off this rally. The main event of the rally was a road to reality, where the audience went through the realities of making poor decisions to drive. The students laid out black paper and yellow dashes to simulate a road. Participants followed the road and stopped at different scenes. The first scene was a party where partiers received a call to find out that one of their friends had been in an accident. The second stop is at a regret room where a teenager recites a poem which is a goodbye to his family as he takes his last breath. Then you are led to a crash scene where a car has hit a bus loaded with a ball team. The local fire department and ambulance services, along with Arch Helicopter, turn this into a training session as well. Then you're taken to an interrogation room, where you see the driver being questioned by the police. Then one of the most dramatic stops on the road is a funeral scene, where you feel as if you are part of the funeral. Lastly, there was a discussion room where students were able to discuss what they had seen and reflect on how it had changed them. After the event, Impacted participated in a national safe driving rally in Washington, D.C. via a live webcast. Here are some highlights from the event. I went to a party, Mom. I remembered what you said. You told me not to drink, Mom, so I drank soda instead. <clears throat> I really felt proud inside, Mom, the way you said I would. I didn't drink and drive, Mom, even though the others said I should. I know I did the right thing, Mom. I know you are always right. Now the party is finally ending, Mom, as everyone is driving out of sight. As I got into my car, Mom, I knew I'd get home in one piece because of the way you raised me, so responsible and sweet. I started to drive away, Mom, but as I pulled out into the road, the other car didn't see me, Mom, and hit me like a load. As I lay there on the pavement, Mom, I hear the policeman say, the other guy is drunk, Mom, and now I'm the one who will pay. I'm lying here dying, Mom. I wish you'd get here soon. How could this happen to me, Mom? My life just burst like a balloon. There's blood all around me, Mom, and most of it is mine. I hear the medics say, Mom, I'll die in a short time. I just wanted to tell you, Mom, I swear I didn't think. It was the others, Mom. The others didn't think. He was probably at the same party as I. The only difference is he drank and I will die. Why do people drink, Mom? It can ruin your whole life. I'm feeling sharp pains now. Pains just like a knife. The guy who hit me is walking, Mom, and I don't think it's fair. I'm lying here dying, and all he can do is stare. Tell my brother not to cry, Mom. Tell Dad to be brave. And when I go to heaven, Mom, but God loves me on my grave. Someone should have told him, Mom, not to drink and drive. If only they had told him, Mom, I would still be alive. My breath is getting shorter, Mom. I'm becoming very scared. 
Please don't cry for me, Mom. When I needed you, you were always there. I have one last question, Mom. Before I say goodbye, I didn't drink and drive. So why am I the one to die? <laughs>